funniest story? Uh, the funniest story, well, looking back, it's a funny story, but at the time it wasn't so funny. So there are two national parks in um, Hawaii that I needed to go shoot. And I'm based in Southern Spain. So in order to get there, I'm, I take a three hour train ride from Sevilla to Madrid, two hour flight from Madrid to Frankfurt. I think like um, an 11 hour flight from Frankfurt to Los Angeles, and then like a five, six hour flight from LA to Honolulu. So whatever, I do all that in sort of one day, whatever that is. And um, I arrive to Honolulu and I go get my car, it hurts. And I walk into the agency, I'm pretty much the only one there because it's a late flight. And I'll never forget this guy at the counter, uh, total character. I mean, he's like uh, really dark black skin with this uh, gray goatee. So the, the contrast of his hair against his skin. And he had this Hawaiian hat on and this uh, yellow flower Hawaiian shirt. He had a name tag, it said Eddie. And so I said, hey, Eddie. He said, hi. He said, oh, you look exhausted. And I said, yeah, I just flew in from Southern Spain. I'm pretty tired. He said, you know what? I'm gonna upgrade you for free. I'm gonna give you this great car, just came in. Uh, it's got GPS built in. You're never going to get lost. I said, great. Oh, Eddie, thank you so much. So do the paperwork, gives me the keys. I go to the car, pack my stuff in the back. I'm sitting in the driver's seat and I'm typing in the address of my hotel in the GPS and um, it loads and then it says, uh, cannot calculate route. I think, hmm, okay, maybe I did that wrong. So I check again, type it in again. And it's loading. It says, cannot calculate route. I'm thinking, Eddie, this car sucks. This car is terrible. So I'm like, whatever. So I go to get my iPad in the trunk and I say, I'll just use uh, Google to get me to my hotel. And so I load up Google Maps, type in the thing, and I'm looking at it and it shows the path to the edge of my island and then a path by boat to another island. So I booked my flight to the wrong island. I was not supposed to be in Honolulu. So I'm like, oh. So pack up the car, like get my stuff from the car, lock it, go back into the agency, open the door and Eddie looks at me and he says, what's wrong with the car? I'm like, oh, Eddie, no, not the car. Actually, I need a boat. I arrived at the wrong island. He said, oh my God, I'm so sorry. He said, look, uh, don't worry about the car. We'll fix it all up. I said, um, look, I'm flying to this island tomorrow. I have to book my ticket. Can you get me a car there? So he does all the arrangements. I get a, a, a room at the airport hotel and then a flight that leaves at 6.30 to go to the island the next day. So get to the hotel, crash, so exhausted. Get to the next island, get my car, it's like 10 in the morning, drive out to the national park. The first thing I do, so not, as to not lose any time, so I drive out to the national park and I get there and the gate is closed. It's a wooden gate and there's this wooden little booth and there's a park ranger in this little window. He's got a name tag like Eddie does, but he's brown, he's like brown clothing, nothing, nothing floral or Hawaiian. And uh, I say, hi. And he's like, morning. And I say, are you going to let me in? He said, uh, the park is closed. I said, what do you mean the park is closed? He said, well, the federal government has yet to decide on a budget. And until that happens, all parks are closed until further noticed. And I said, e you don't understand. I have flown in from the south of Spain to be here. He said, oh, that's a good one. I've gotten Australia. Japan. I said, no, 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 you, know, you don't get it. Like, I only came here to be at this park to take one photograph. I didn't come here for the beach. I didn't come here for the pina coladas. Only this one photo. He said, sorry, man, catch, can't let you in. So turn around, go back to the hotel, waited out two days. And then uh, sure enough, after those two days, it was open and I got my shot and I was able to get out of there. So funny at the time, no, but definitely looking back. Pretty funny.